With the curfew, a countywide curfew in Onondaga County remains in place as you wake up this morning. News Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc joins us now to explain what this means. First of all, Julia, does this apply to people who are heading to work today? It doesn't, Dan. And again, that curfew going into effect last night at 8 p.m. and remaining until 7 o'clock this morning. But nobody has to be worried about heading to work this morning. That's allowed, as well as other essential services like fire, police, or medical personnel. Really, what the countywide curfew is meant to do is keeping the general public off the streets. So no driving or walking during that time frame. For local businesses, you're not required to shut down during those hours, but the county is encouraging big box stores to adjust their hours. Wegmans already jumping on the bandwagon and shutting its doors last night at 8. Centro Bus is also shutting down their operations by the curfew time. Mayor Ben Walsh says the curfew is meant to be used as a tool, not only for those who are protesting, but those who are not, because the best way to keep everybody safe is to keep them home. Didn't want to escalate, unnecessarily escalate uh, the situation. Um, so we, we made sure they were aware of it. Uh, and, but ultimately, the, the police stood back, showed a lot of restraint, and, and we ended up with the outcome that we were looking for. Now we're told Central will be picking its services back up this morning. Wegmans opening up as well. That curfew was expected to be in place until June 5th, unless the county decides to lift it sooner. Dan. Okay, Julia, thank you. Peaceful.